of you noticed, I've uh, done something to the layout. Yeah, I put it on a baseboard now, which is something that I really, really wanted to do. And now uh, finally I did it. First off, that siding over there, due to that siding, the layouts had to be slanted a bit to be able to fit it on the actual board. So, what my plan is, is to hopefully, if it works, um, replace one of them curves into a curved point. So, it would make it longer and it would also mean the layout wouldn't, be ha wouldn't have to be slanted. So yeah, that would be a bonus. Second off, uh, those points there, they will be changed to Pico Streamline points. So uh, yeah. I thought it was about time I needed to change the points to something more realistic and something that's more better. And next it's something to do with the middle of the layout. So hopefully about sort of here-ish there'll be a bit of a line going off which will lead to a small depot and a turntable. Probably another another Pico item. I haven't decided whether I want a small halt there yet or not, but we'll soon see with time. And the shed is probably either going to be like a two road shed with inspection pit or maybe something bigger. I have no idea. And lastly, this section down here is going to host a station soon. No idea how big the station will be yet, but yeah, there's plans for a station to be here. I might have to think about if I had to relocate them or something. Hmm, not sure. I know one thing for sure. These failed being over there because they interfered with the coaches going over the points. So I've had to move them here. And I may have to move them again. No idea where. Hmm. I suppose all the problems will be solved when I actually get on with it. So yeah, that's what's going to happen to the layout in the future. Hopefully it'll look a lot better than what it is now. So yeah.